My name is Gift Nikayaramba. I'm a junior here at Duke University. I'm on the Robertson Scholarship and I am studying electrical and computer engineering. I'm passionate about solar energy because being from Zimbabwe, we are blessed with a lot of natural resources, especially in this case, the sun. Uh, we have a lot of sunlight over the course of the year, but then we also have energy problems. When I came to Duke, I became passionate about solar energy because it was a way to solve this problem uh, of energy using resources that are widely available in Zimbabwe. One challenge that comes with that is that uh, solar energy as is at the moment is very expensive. But the group that I'm working on is to bring down the cost of solar energy. And they're doing this by fabricating these organic solar cells. And what we're working on is improving their efficiency so that they can go to market in a sustainable way. This is what I'm talking about when I talk about a solar cell. We're talking of uh, a small unit that produces energy from the sun. What I'm doing is getting these cells and trying to understand what exactly is happening as they are converting solar energy to electrical energy. So this uh, is an atomic force mic microscope and what it allows us to do is to zoom in on the surface uh, of these organic solar cells on a nanoscale. So this we're talking of 10 to the power minus 9 meters. Points with different brightness and from this we can then form a three-dimensional image of what the surface of the solar cell looks like. And from there, we can sort of find ways to improve that efficiency. In the future, it is hoped that uh, we'll be able to replace a lot of uh, the conventional sources of energy like hydroelectric with solar energy because it's widely available. It's an outlet of my passion, my energy that greatly excites me and that's what brings me here for four or five hours every weekend. And at the moment, I'm thinking of going to graduate school uh, and continuing the study of solar cells and working on better improving them because it's an area of passion of mine and I want to see it benefit people's lives.